Merry Christmas, everybody. Just running around now. It's the day after Christmas now. It's the 26th. But running around, grabbing the checks. Just over here. One of my facilities grabbing the check that they left. They left for for us here. And then I'm going to shoot back home to get back on my laptop to finally submit the bid for the, the Eagle Construction. Uh, I stayed up until 4 a.m. Kind of just doing the research of, you know, my, you know, my local prices and, um, you know, com competitors' prices and, you know, typical rates and my hourly rate. Yeah, just to get, have all the numbers to compare to see which, you know, see what the best uh, you know, price would be for us to go by. I was able to go ahead and convert it to the cost per square foot for the client since that's the way they want it. Uh, it was like, my first time doing it. I I called everybody I knew. I called, you know, my aunt who runs her own cleaning company down in Louisiana or Texas, uh, you know, for, for advice tried to get in contact with my brother who's a you know project manager for a huge power company you know in, in the south energy uh, I called I called everybody I knew who could possibly help me and nobody answered the phone so I'll know that if I do this if, it, if I'm successful with getting this account then it was all me so that's the most exciting uh, but yeah I'm excited to go home and submit the numbers I got an email from the project manager uh, this morning uh, that let us know that we will not have to do um, trash removal so any big debris and stuff they'll they'll take care of themselves so it's not something we have to worry about so I don't have to worry about finding numbers to, to submit, a, submit a bit for that so makes it easier we're pretty much ready to go so I'll probably you know, go take you guys with me to hop on the computer and uh and uh, yeah, we'll submit those numbers and hopefully we get um, yeah, we get the, the count. It would definitely change our entire business. As for now, picking up checks, headed to the bank to deposit said checks. It is a good day, good day, good day. So sitting here in front of my QuickBooks and just just sent off the quote. Good job. Thank you, thank you very much. And hopefully we hear back from them soon. I did not try the pie either. But yeah, super excited, very, very nervous. And I uh, will see what they say. Yeah, I have nothing else to do. We shall see. Hello again. So, we heard back from Eagle Construction on the job. And they definitely want us to get started yesterday, which is great news. Uh, but they don't want to commit to any particular amount of units until they've seen us work so uh they want to you know see how we do over the next 30 days before making any type of commitment which is cool with me because i'm i have all the confidence in the world that we can get it done well especially with what they're asking us to start out with it's coming into the middle of a project just for a a, a final claim before they show the house so me and maddie are in home depot the friendly neighborhood home depot Grabbing whatever extra supplies we think we might need to make sure we get a good job done. So, we're up to now. Got a big new bottle of Windex. Even though we won't be doing windows. Not on Friday anyway. Friday is when they want us to come and get started on this the first house. Pledge. Might I find some pledge? 
Because this is the scent we like. Uh -huh. Whoa! <laughs> oh, it does smell good, actually. Yeah. Got it. Got a good whiff. Grab two because we never have it. I feel like Gugon should be right here as well. Oh my god, the tiny thing of the end Oh. Uh, I want to grab some of this, but what's the difference between the blue and the yellow? It's one, one's fume free and one's heavy duty. Hey, we, have this in the we do have it. Yeah. Same thing. Yeah, hardwood is what we have. You should get one of both. Easy off. I really have no planned use for the easy off, but I'm gonna get one fumeless and one heavy duty. Uh, just cause I see another cleaner swear by it and I don't wanna be without should it come up that I need it. So we'll have it just in case. Uh, what else are we getting? We do need towels, microfiber towels, which we wanted to get from Costco. We're probably eventually gonna end up going and getting the Kirkland brand. I feel like we're missing something else from this aisle that we can use. There's too much cleaning stuff over here for that too. There's towels right here. Yeah. See if you can like maybe uh, crack one open and uh, see if how it feels. Don't do that. She's stealing, she's stealing. Yeah, we have a couple things. Simple green. Still looking for like one solid cleaning products distributor. I was thinking about, been thinking about going with simple green. Because it seems like the easiest solution of all the different cleaners, one spot. If I could have that and an equipment supplier, then we'd be good to go. We'd be able to map out our costs and you know, be a little bit more accurate with stuff. Solid with our numbers. You like those? Yeah, there's 24 here. Are they both good? So, 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 so. Yeah, I mean, thicker, heavier, duty, or top. Do you feel like this is the same kind as gonna leave like those threads, like the cheaper ones we got from Amazon? No, these are definitely better than the Amazon. These are definitely better than that. No. All right. If we can tell them apart from the Amazon ones, I would say just get both. One and one from, you're right, since we do still ultimately want to get one from Costco. What do you think, which ones do you think are better? Mm. These? Mm -hmm. And she has decided, we have, we're going with the HDX brand. Large microfiber towels. Boom. Done deal. Well, not done, but towels are checked for now. Temporary towels. Towels that we got from Amazon are horrible. She could do Friday. Mm -hmm. Awesome, and we have a second set of hands for the job on Friday, which will allow me to take more of an overhead look and still do some. What's that? We pay like for the full five. We pay for the full five hours at her normal rate. Plus a tip if she's good. Yeah, yeah, it's like six. Yeah, five. So, plus tips if you if we do a great job and get paid. Yep. I know we also need to look into getting a water fed hose pipe and the pressure washer with the different nozzles. I don't know why that really excites me. I'm really excited to like get a pressure washer. <laughs> what else did I say? I just said it and I forgot. What, else? what did I say? Yeah. Nobody listens to me. Even me. Uh, I don't even listen hose. to me. Water fed hose. Yes. Is that what they're called? Well, yeah. For window washing. High windows. So I do know that that is something that they want to earn. And they're in high. Well, they're demanding it. Oh, high demand. So Distracted by refrigerator. Fancy electronics. Whoa, built-in water filter thing. That's 
fancy. Neato, neato. I have too much fun at Home Depot. Straight ahead. I'm afraid this might all be rental equipment though. Oh yeah, that is. That's it's full of rental. I think it's going to have to be an online purchase. I don't know where you can buy stuff. It's definitely. So the driveway and surface cleaner is going to be on the next page over. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you so much. Yeah, of course. Thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate Anything it. else all I can right. do for you tonight? No, sir. That'll be that'll be all. Let's take a look at some of the stuff that we have here. Awesome. Thanks so much, man. Yeah, extremely of course. helpful. You have a wonderful evening. You as well. That was easy enough. Well, uh, well, renting. I'm gonna figure out how much they're gonna cost cost because they're definitely gonna need one. Oh. Here's bags. Bags. Oh, yeah. Construction cleanup bags. Construction contract cleanup bags. How bad? 42 gallon. Why does that sound small? Hmm. Is anything bigger than 42 gallon? Nothing like amazing. Nothing like amazing. Hmm. Shall see? Okay. We have found the Goo Gone. We've also found little booties and masks so that we're not cracking up the place. I just wanted to find some of these specific mop holders and mop heads, and then we're out of here. That's a bulb changer. It's definitely not what I'm looking for. Okay, well that was wrong. So we found everything except for specific tile type of mop stick that we want. Like instead of clamping down on the mop head, it like squeezes it. Some type of different way than the one we have now. Like we have these. We have those already. There's a different style that we want. And we're looking for them. But we can't find it. So, and it's not at Home Depot. But we did find a bunch of other stuff that we need. Some bigger garbage bags just so we have some for cleanup. Not to mention one of our clients is out and we're just going to help them out. Help hold them over until they order new ones because we're nice like that. Try to keep clients happy. I think we are set to do a decent job on Friday. Impress them. Win the big monies. Oh, we also need extension cords. Good thinking. Long extension cords. 60 feet is pretty long. On clearance. On clearance? Yeah, let's do it. We should get a, get a couple of them if we need to. I don't feel like all our extension cords are broken. They don't have grounds anymore. Whoa, what is that? Oh, no. Oh, no. Same plan we have, just a different rag type. Fancy though. Oh, this is like Clarence. Clarence is a good space to be. All right, I think we're just about ready to skedaddle. Yeah. Look out of here. Oh, are these brand new pressure washers? No, these are generators. I feel like they should be in the same area, though. 
You did find them? Hey, you're right. 2900 PSI. What? 150. Lies. Lies. They're not that cheap. I'll buy one today. We need a four gallon per. Can't remember something released though. Hey, oh, this one's four hundred dollars. This one's three sixty nine. Okay, so the price all over. I'm gonna look at some some pressure washers. Dewalt. We don't need thirty four. We don't need more than twenty five hundred. Like I mean, three thousand psi. Bucks. So this three hundred dollar Roby might be good to grow with for a little bit. Windows decking siding drivers inside well. Uh, which one? This. Well. The which one? The one that's the two hundred? Uh, yeah, I like that. I like the three hundred dollar one. Yeah. Thank you. Is what I've learned now in spending money for equipment in the business world is as much money as you would feel comfortable spending, it's probably about almost double that, like 50% more than that. But as long as you have it, you should probably swing for the better equipment. So it'll probably last you a little bit longer and get your money's worth than the cheap ones breaking down and having to replace them every two months. So we've done that with vacuums. And now we know why people just buy four hundred, five hundred dollar vacuums over and over again because we do it now. Excuse me. I like it. I like it. We're gonna be able to do that pretty stiff, pretty soon. Go ahead and grab this uh, this pressure washer. Is that a hose? I like it. It was fun, fun day here in Home Depot. I think we're good. Also found a nifty little, little cord clampers. Hang them up in places. We struggle with keeping cords organized. Merry Christmas. Simba. Don't break stuff. <laughs>